ค่ะ I am Tulip นักสมภพ Welcome to Buddhism Today where the world discover Thai way of Buddhism Some of my foreign friends have wondered why the way we worship the Buddha image is different from the way we pay respect to the Buddhist monk. Today we will take a look at the way we pay respect to both Buddhist monk and the Buddha image. It is a custom for all Buddhists or non-Buddhists. When they go to the temple, you are required to pay respect to a Buddha image, which we remind of the, the virtue of the Buddha and then even the Buddhist monks, what you call the Sangha. So it is a Buddhist custom, just like any other religious places or in any other religion, that uh, when you go to the places and then if you have an enshrine there, then you pay respect to those enshrine. You pay respect to the, those, uh, those objects, sacred objects. So in Buddhism, it is regarded Buddha image or the, the Buddha statue as a part of a sacred object. In fact, the Buddha image itself is, in fact, is nothing. It's just kind of uh, statues. But what we think when we worship or when we prostrate to the Buddha image that actually the virtues of the Buddha. And when we worship the Buddha, basically we are reminding of those virtues and then how to develop those virtues within ourselves. So we are using the Buddha as a, just a mirror of reflections of ourselves and then how we can develop, how we can improve, improve ourselves to be a Buddha-like. Uh, therefore, the way what we do is that uh, when you go to the Buddhist temple in front of a Buddhist shrines, it's be a Buddhist Buddha image to, uh, to the certain place, what is that uh, you do the Benchanga Pradit three times. What Benchanga Pradit means that is five-pointed five prostrations. So basically, it's a one is a head and uh, two is a your, your elbows and two is your knee so you have to uh, you have to kneel knee down and then put your elbows down onto the floor and put your head up to the floor so that is a way of worshiping the full way of proper way of worshiping the buddha image and even to the actually to the buddhist monks but in fact if the monks are walking or monks are standing how do we do that so generally it's called kan wai basically a give away a give away is basically is that you just you just pay a respect. It's a simplified way of respecting. So it is a, you, you can just stand and you, you put your, your both hand as a you know, lotus posture. And then what you do is that uh, uh, generally the head is regarded as very high. So you put down your head like this. So it will be a, a, you know, sort of a gesture of uh, showing your respect to the uh, Buddhist Sangha. But if the Buddhist Sangha is sitting, of course, Buddhist Sangha is again, the Buddhist monks is again, is symbolizing the triple gem. So what you do is that the same as the, when you prostrate to the Buddha images or any Buddhist sacred object, you prostrate it three times too. Uh, but uh, the meaning of the prostrating three times to the Buddhist monk there is that uh, we are prostrating to the Buddha, we are prostrating to the Dhamma, we are prostrating to the Sangha. So basically it is uh, prostrating or uh, worshipping the three triple gems. <laughs>